I'm just about to reveal some of the most creative ways you can make use of ChatGPT to improve your marketing game and take it to the next level, so let's get started. Now, I'm pretty confident you know how ChatGPT works and there's no need for me to explain it. I mean, everybody's talking about it right now. If we check Google Trends, we can see that ChatGPT is at an all-time high in terms of popularity it's actually got a score of 100 out of 100 in terms of interest. Everybody's searching for it. Everybody's using ChatGPT right now for all sorts of different purposes. And that's because it's got some insane capabilities. Not only can it explain difficult concepts in very simple terms, it's pretty good with creative ideas as well. And in the following minutes, I'm about to reveal some of the best ways you can use it for marketing. Now, here's a very specific scenario. Let's just say that you are selling products online. You're either doing e-commerce with your own website or you're selling items on Amazon, for instance. Well, what you can make use of ChatGPT for is writing better descriptions to help you rank higher. In other words, you can use ChatGPT for search engine optimization. I mean, look at this. I'm simply going to copy the name of this product right here and now ask ChatGPT to write the product description for it. Write me an Amazon product description for this product and ChatGPT will follow my instructions right away. Now, if this is too long or it doesn't fit the style that you want, you can keep on making changes to it. For instance, you can ask it to summarize it, make it straight to the point or even turn it into a list of bullet points. There you have it. I'm just gonna send in the instruction and ChatGPT will execute right away. And so even though this is not necessarily a content writing tool, it's a language model, ChatGPT can be pretty helpful with writing content. And so talking about that, you can also use it for writing scripts. For instance, let's just say that you're using some sort of a sales funnel in order to sell your products online. Well, you can ask ChatGPT to write the entire copy for your sales page. Let's say that you're an online dating coach, for instance, and you want to write the landing page script for your funnel. Well, you can ask ChatGPT to do it. It is going to search through all of its database and come up with the relevant result. Now, of course, you can pause the video and actually read the script if you want to, but I can tell you it's pretty good. Remember, ChatGPT works with a huge database that is not necessarily up to date, but it has a lot of information that it can reference. Now, remember, if we go back to the portal here and open ChatGPT once more, we can see that it can also be pretty good with generating creative ideas, and that is quite surprising if you ask me, but we can make use of it. Let's just pick a field of activity. Let's say that you're a medical expert who's focusing on nutrition, for instance. And so I'm a nutritionist and I offer online one-on-one -on -one coaching, right? This is a very specific example. Give me a list, 10 video ideas that I can create for my YouTube channel. It's 2023 and if you want to stand out from the crowd, regardless of which field of activity you specialize on, you need to put out content. You need to build a reputation for yourself and build a social media following. It's one of the best things you can do to reach more people. And you can do that with the help of ChatGPT. Look at this. The truth about fat diets. Look at this, cooking with whole foods on a budget, understanding macronutrients and how they affect your body, the importance of hydration and how to stay hydrated. Each and every single one of these can be the title for a YouTube video. And we can take it from here. We can ask ChatGPT to make them a little more controversial, for instance, in order to get more engagement. And look at this, it is going to rewrite each and every single one of these titles in a more controversial manner. And I'm pretty sure that is going to boost up your engagement and reach more people. Look at this, why counting calories is not always the answer. The dark side of the diet industry. These are far better titles and video ideas. Why detox teas and juice cleanses do more harm than good. Let me actually copy that title right here. And believe it or not, we can even ask ChatGPT to write us the entire script for that YouTube video. Write me a full YouTube script for a video with this title. I'm gonna paste that in and hit enter. And it will start writing it ASAP. It's even going to provide you with instructions and directions as to what kind of footage you should use, what kind of transitions you should make, to keep people hooked. The thing about this is that the only limitation here is literally your imagination because ChatGPT has got some insane capabilities. It's just on you to send you the right instructions and make use of it correctly. And so if you don't like this basic script right here for a YouTube video, of course you can ask it to make improvements. You can ask it to make it a little bit more readable, a little bit more engaging. You can even ask ChatGPT to add some humor to it. And let's even take it one step further. You see, posting long format videos is pretty good. It's definitely going to help. It's better than not posting anything at all. And these are some pretty good video ideas, to be honest. But we're in 2023 and short content seems to be the new trend now. We're talking about YouTube Shorts, Instagram Reels, TikToks. All of these social media platforms are trying to integrate short videos and they're pretty successful with it. For some reason, people don't have a very big attention span. And so if you manage to get your point across in a very short, engaging manner, 
You can reach a lot more people than you can with regular content. It's a lot easier to get views with short videos. And so instead of asking ChatGPT to create a longer script, we can even ask it to create a TikTok script based on these titles. Look at this. The truth about gluten and why it's not always bad for you. I'm just gonna copy that and ask it to write me a TikTok video script for this title. Now, if everything goes according to plan, it should do that in just a few seconds. So you can take your time to actually record these videos. And once you're done with these 10, you can ask it for another 10 videos. Or you can do something even smarter than that. Once once you start posting content, you can take a close look at your insights, then see what videos perform and what videos do not perform and try to use ChatGPT in order to double down on the winners and only post relevant content. Here's what I mean. If the fifth video here ranks out for some reason and it performs a lot better than the others, you want to post similar content. You want to keep posting similar videos to this one. So I could just copy the title of that clip and then I'm going to ask ChatGPT to create 10 more video ideas similar to that one. Look at this. Create 10 more titles about nutrition similar to this one. Understanding macronutrients and how they affect your body. Here's the first one, the importance of balancing macronutrients in your diet. We've got 10 different options here. And so it goes without saying that using ChatGPT for content creation purposes is a pretty good idea. And you can even use it for competitive research. Let's just say that you're planning to grow your social media presence by posting content, right? So the first thing you're going to do is take a look at the creators that are already posting content in your niche and try to reverse engineer what they are doing. Try to model their content strategy. That's a pretty good idea, but that takes time. So let's have a look at this. As you can see, if I search for a nutrition hacks, let's just stick to this niche, I'm going to find a bunch of different content creators posting consistently. And this video right here got a pretty good performance. So what you can do instead of watching the whole video and trying to break down what's going on behind the scenes is that you can ask ChatGPT to break it down. I could literally go over to the transcript on YouTube, toggle the timestamp so that I can properly copy the entire thing. And once I'm done with that, I can send it over to ChatGPT and ask it to break it down for me. Why do you think this video performed really well on YouTube? Title, transcript. And now I'm just going to paste in the relevant text. There's the transcript and I'm also going to give you the title because that's an important part of the equation as well. There you go. And now ChatGPT is actually going to read that and provide you with useful insight. This video performed well on YouTube because it provides useful and actionable tips. The speaker is a certified holistic nutritionist, providing credibility to the information. Additionally, the video is well produced. It features a partnership, and this only took a few seconds instead of you watching the whole video all the way through for 10 minutes. That's gonna save you a lot of time. And so guys, let's just sum it up. We're talking about search engine optimization, which is an important bit of marketing. We're talking about writing scripts and writing text for websites, writing copy for ads, for instance, even writing scripts for your videos. Then you can also use ChatGPT to get more video ideas if you're planning to post more content. You can ask it to repurpose content. You can use it for competitive research and break down the strategy of other content creators in your space. And these were just a few examples. I'm pretty sure that you can see a lot more use cases for ChatGPT once you start using it. We've got all the resources you need to take your marketing game to the next level. So that's it for now and thanks for watching.